decimals. Today we will learn about decimals. Let us review place value in 1 and 2 place decimal numbers. Look at this square. The square is divided into 10 equal parts. See the colored part shows 3 by 10 of the square. We can also write this in decimal form as 0 0.3. Look at this grid. Here the square is divided into 10 equal parts. The colored part shows 1 by 10 of the square. And we can write this as the in decimal form as 0 0.1. Look at this square. Here the square is divided into 100 equal parts. So the colored part shows 1 by 100. We can also write in decimal form as 0 0.01. Here, after see in 100, there are two zeros. So, after the decimal point, there will be two decimal places. So, 0 0.01. Here, the square is divided into 100 equal parts. Out of that, 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 are shaded. So the fraction for the shaded part is 24 by 100. And we can write it as decimal as 0 0.24. Look at the colored part here. This square is divided into 10 equal parts. All the 10 parts are shaded. So we can call it as one whole. And here also one whole. And here as one whole. And here it is divided into 10 parts. And out of that 1, 2, 3, 4 parts are shaded. So 4 out of 10 are shaded. So this fraction we can write in decimal form as 3.4. That is 3 whole parts and 4 by 10 that is 3.4 take another example here the, this square is divided into 100 equal parts and all part is shaded so we can call it as one whole and here also one whole and here 10 20 30 40, 50, 60, 61, 62 out of 100 is shaded. So, all together we can say this as 2 whole parts and 62 out of 100 is shade, shaded. So, 2, 62 by 100 in decimal form we can write it as 2.62. Let us see how fractions can be represented by decimal numbers. First one, 6 by 10. In 10, there is 1 0. So, in decimal number, there will be 1 decimal place after the decimal point. So, 6 by 10 is equal to, in decimal form, 0 0.6. Next, 35 by 100. In 100, there are 2 zeros. So, and we write in decimal, it will be 0 0.35. In the next one, 4, 3 by 10. So when we write as decimal, in place of 0, it will be 4. So the whole number is here. So 4.3. And here 6, 3 by 100, it will be 6.03. The next one, 17, 5 by 10. It will be 17.5. 17 and the next one, 3 by 100. It will be 0 